Shalom Aleichem, hope everyone had a wonderful, wonderful week. This week we read Parshas Kisavo, a Parsha of Brachos and Klalos, the Tochacha. And I want to make two very, very quick points. First, an unbelievable Sforno, back from Parshas Re'e. The Torah tells us, Re'e, Anochi, Nosei Lachem, Hayom, Bracho, Klala. And the Sforno comments over there in the beginning of Parshas Re'e, that when it comes to Bracho and Klala, he says most of the world lives in the world of what he calls Benoni, a world of mediocrity. And he says the message of that pasuk, bracha and klala, is that's not how we should be looking at the world. Is a Jew does not shoot for mediocrity, does not shoot for bees. A Jew shoots for A's. And we shoot for bracha, we strive for bracha, we position ourselves for bracha. If we're just shooting for mediocrity, for average, for benoni, that's not what we're looking for. And perhaps even that's what we'll call, that's already klala, that's already klala. Is that life is, has extremes. There is good and bad. Not everything is okay. Not everything goes. Not everything we tolerate. A vision of bracha and klala and striving for excellence in all that we do. That's the Sfarn at the beginning of Parsha Re'eh. Then we have a beautiful idea in this week's Parsha. The Torah tells us that when these brachos, perachav ches pasuk beis, when these brachos come to you, you'll go ahead and you'll get all of these brachos. And then the Torah says, vihisi gucha, and they will reach you. And the question is asked, the unklus implies, why do we need, you already told me we're going to get the brachos, and then it says, vihisigucha, and they will reach you. So the unklus adds, what's the explanation of the word, vihisigucha, vayedab kenucha, and they will attach to you. Because a person could be the recipient of bracha, but will not know how to make it stick, will not know how to make it attach, will not enable it to really transform his life. We get so many brachos, but sometimes we squander those brachos. We don't use those brachos in the right way. Reports are that 70% of lottery winners squander their money within seven years that broke. They got bracha and they squandered it. They couldn't figure out that critical, critical word, make the brachos attach. We live in a life of bracha. And sometimes that's Hashem's job, to bestow us with bracha. Our job is to make sure it sticks, make sure it attaches. Have a wonderful Shabbos Kodesh.